Today, Kevin and I are going to do a pickle comparison video for you. And what started this whole video was a friend of mine, Lila, she bought these about a year ago, these Grillo's pickles. She bought them in Costco and she raved and raved and raved about them about how fresh they are, how wonderful they are. And so I thought we have got to get to Costco and find these pickles. At that time we had a membership. Went to Costco, they never had them. Never had them. Never we had every them. Time we went. Yes. So our membership ran out. I went uh, with my sister, because my sister has a membership, and they had them. I said, oh my gosh, they have those pickles, so I have to get these pickles. That's funny. But I wanted to compare them with some of the brands that you see on the grocery store shelves. Now these are refrigerated. You buy them in the refrigerated section at Costco. These two were bought on the shelf at room temperature at Walmart, but we've had all of them in the refrigerator so that we're giving them all a fair shake. We generally like cold pickles anyway. We like so. cold pickles. We don't leave them in the cabinet. So we're gonna give you the cost as we go. The Grillo's pickles were $5.99 at Costco, and that is for a 32 ounce container. The Mount Olive were $1.98 at Walmart, and that is for a 24 ounce container. And I have the Vlasic uh, sandwich dill chips, and they were um, $2.32 at Walmart, and it is a 24 ounce. Yeah, this is 24. So mine were $1.98. Mine were $2.32. Okay, so you're paying more for the Vlasic brand anyway. Just if you compare these two, you're gonna pay more. Uh, so what do you, do you wanna try one that's been around for a while before we go to the Grillo's? Whatever, whatever you want. Uh, let's do the Mount Olive. We tried to get like sandwich, just the regular deal chips um, because we didn't wanna be unfair because I, I wanted to try um, a couple of other brands of pickles. You can get a couple of them out. Just he did. He wanted to try some, and I said, and, but they were like um, wicked or spicy or something like that, and and, um, and so we didn't want to be unfair. And some of them come in spears, yeah. and you know we wanted to make sure that we were comparing chip to chip. So these, I should tell you the calories. These are zero. Uh, Fifteen servings in the container, one ounce. This is something. Uh, it's gluten free and vegan. Uh, this is something that uh, when uh, Kevin uh, was like first dieting and stuff, he would eat pickles. That would be a lot my snack. Because they're zero calories. Well, some of them are zero calories. But I like, yeah, you have to look. I like the zesty spears. Those were good. Mm. Not Britney spears, zesty spears. That is so good. That is good. Good deal, deal flavor, uh, mm -hmm. good amount of vinegar. I always like the spears as well. Yeah, the spears are but really But they only had these in this form. Chips. And somebody else told me, they commented when they saw these in the grocery hall, that they sell these at Target. Oh, and we've never seen that over. They do have, at other Targets, they have more varieties of these pickles. Our Target that we shop at. Neither one of them. Well, one of them, the one way on the other side of town, has one kind of these oh. listed on their website. Yeah. But apparently other targets carry uh, different varieties. We just don't uh, have those. The, the, the target that we shop at has a grocery section, but it's not near as big as the grocery section on the other side of town, which um, we do go to occasionally, but it's like a 40 minute drive. So why wouldn't you go to the one that's 20 minutes, you know, away? So are these... Um, yeah. These, These say five calories. For two slices. Oh, for two. Mm -hmm. Have Which you eaten one yet? Not yet. I'm working on it. Trying to get me one that's not huge. They're all pretty big though. Wow. <laughs> I have thoughts just on those two. Dude, that's not very good. No. And that's, ugh. It says no artificial dyes, but you wouldn't know that. It does uh, have a chemical like flavor. Why are people paying more for that name? Vlasic is the classic name. Whenever I buy pickle relish though, I you try to buy the Mount Olive because yeah. I really like their pickle relish and stuff. These Mount Olive are twice as good as those Vlasic. Yeah. That is so interesting to me. And they're no calories. Because some things I'm more of a, a brand snob. Some things I am. Not a lot of things, but some I am because, I mean, when there's a clear difference, there's a clear difference. These are better than those. And 
if you buy Vlasic, I would challenge you uh, to try uh, the Mount Olive if that's if that's what you're loyal to because these are delicious. They, these have like a, a little bit of a chemical flavor. I ate yes, another one do. of those. Mm -hmm. They've got that good vinegary still sharpness to yeah, them. Yeah, it tastes fresher and those do have a chemical flavor to them. That's amazing. Yeah. I would have not thought that. No, you would have thought Because I would have thought they'd more. be about the same. Yeah. I would have thought they would have been the same. We like the, the Mount Olive and they're cheaper. I mean cheaper in low calorie. Now this... Uh, yeah, don't get pickle juice everywhere. Oh, well, let me read before I open it. <laughs> Pull tab back lift lid to close press firmly. I started Grillo's out of a pickle cart in Boston, Massachusetts in 2008. The 100 year old recipe was passed down from my grandfather. We still hand pack a few simple ingredients into each jar, giving you the freshest, most delicious pickle, pickle possible. Pickle in, possible. Pickle possible. His name is actually Grillo. Travis Grillo. Well, that's cool. Okay, uh, gluten-free, a fat-free food, certified kosher. I think it was made up like a gruffalo. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> there's no such thing as a gruffalo. Okay, um, one ounce, 28 grams, about five chips. It says five calories. Okay. So, one calorie each. Well, there's a lot of name brands. Betty Crocker, there's not really a Betty Crocker. You know, there's all kinds of names. There might have like been that. some neighbor that he named. Uncle Ben, I bet you there's not an Uncle Ben. Mm -hmm. might <laughs> Will you get that? It's hard. The plastic is tough. You might have to use that. I don't want you to hurt your hand. Ooh. Pickle juice. Pickle juice. One of my favorite kids' hey, what? books. It's a little messy. Ooh, wow. One of my favorite kids' books is called Pickle Things. So, oh my gosh. Garlic? <laughs> garlic straw. Pickle things. And I think it was written by like Mark Brown or something like that. But it says, pickle things you never see. Like pickles on a Christmas tree. A pickle ear and a pickle nose. Pickle hair and pickle toes. And it's showing you each page. And and I probably, I could go on and on because I've read this book so many times. Yeah. Um, but That was to Andrew. You didn't read it to Ashley. I read it to Ashley, but not as much as with yeah. Andrew. I remember with Andrew was all of them. Each page, like they'll show a Christmas tree and it has pickles all over it and a pickle nose and pickle hair. And it's a really, really cute book. If you've never seen it, it it's it's cute. These, the smell is incredible. It's very strong garlicky smell. And they're white. Do you see the difference in the color? Mm -hmm. Were those the Mount Olive? No, those are Vlasic. New Mount Olive too. Oh, okay. The Vlasic uh, look more fake green. Like a fake Christmas tree. Those are good. They have a very... And right at first I didn't... I, I didn't... It was like almost watery. Mm -hmm. But then after you've ate, eaten it, you get the garlic coming through. Um, they are get, very fresh. You don't get quite as much of the dill and the vinegar flavor, though. I'm wondering if down in there too, were they really, really soaked in that juice? Yeah, I don't know. I got, I got one out of the juice pretty good. Uh huh. These are good. I don't uh -huh. know that they would, they wouldn't overpower your hamburger if you're eating these on a sandwich. Mm -hmm. It would be good on a sandwich because it's not going to be overpowering. It's just going to be a nice pickle flavor. Um, the dill is not very strong though for me. No, it honestly, it's a uh, lighter flavor. these are very good. Mm -hmm. They're very nice and you can tell they're very, very, very fresh. Um, and you can just tell in the color of them alone. They're crisp. Um, and those Vlasic were almost uh, mushy mm -hmm. uh, in texture in comparison to these. They're very, very crisp. So I do think out of these three, those are the freshest mm -hmm. ones, but I really do like the flavor of the Mount Olive. Yeah, the Mount Olive really have a I, I truly, flavor. yes. And so if you don't have I a Costco walk. membership, I know, I'm tempted to go back to it. If you don't have a Costco membership, uh, then, and you don't have these at your Target, no, these dark ones okay. are the Mount Olive. Okay, I thought the it was lighter one, one. No, the lighter ones are the Vlasic, but. Yeah, I think I just like the Mount Olive ones better. They have more of what I consider a traditional pickle flavor. Mm -hmm. It's more of that flavor that, that we're used to that we buy all the time. I do like these. I do like them too. I, there's nothing wrong I with them. I think they're excellent quality. They have more of a garlic pickle flavor yes, than a pickle Yes, but what would I pick flavor. again and again? I would pick them out all. Yeah. 
just because it, it, it's just a stronger flavor and they're crispy too. Mm -hmm. They so are very crispy. These are the most crispy, but the Mount Olive were very crispy too. And I would pass on those plastic. I will, I I'm will not, I again. need to remember that because I don't want to ever, I won't do that again because it's such a huge difference. And they do have a chemical flavor when you have them side by side. They're strong. Yeah. And so, um, I am glad we tried this. I am too. This is so strong. The garlic oh, it is smells amazing. wonderful. Yeah, the smell I think is a lot stronger than the flavor. Yeah, it is because I think the flavor is a little light. Oh, but it, but they're still good. They're very. Yeah. So I will have a picture for you at the end. And thanks for watching.